are you, what are you videotaping for? The cops aren't gonna do Cell phone video capturing this woman, Lorene Lake, in action at the apartment complex where she lives in Long Beach. Neighbors say she terrorizes them daily. Allegations include damaging property, blasting loud music in the middle of the night, <laughs> screaming threats at the top of her lungs, morning, bye, morning. and spewing racist rhetoric on camera to her black neighbor, Yucatan Everett Mason, who posted the now viral video on social media. This should go right around your neck, you little and every day I'm praying to God, this isn't the day she just decides to blast me through this window and I'm dead. Mason says Lake never liked him since he moved there in December. People ask, well, what's the other side of the story? What'd you do? I moved in and I was black. Literally, is literally what I did. And Mason is not alone. She told me she was going to find a way to kill me. Raquel Sepulveda says she filed a restraining order against Lake, but her surveillance video shows Lake still coming to her door. You know, they think a restraining order is a protection for you. It's just a piece of paper. You know, if someone comes to you and tells you they're going to kill you, what do you do? Put the paper up? She needs to be put away. On Thursday night, Lake was put away, arrested after violating Sepulveda's restraining order. Long Beach police say Lake had an inoperable gun on her, which police took, and Lake was booked on felony and misdemeanor charges. But Lake was also arrested in July and landed right back at the complex. Neighbors have complained to the property managers from International City Property Management. This is why we contact property management, and they've done nothing for three months. Fox 11 spoke to a property manager representative from the company who did not want to be identified. He says management has tried to evict Lake since May, but has faced legal hurdles to do so. Management says they're taking Lake to court and are now planning to put a building-wide restraining order in place, too. Property management says it's a slow process, but neighbors say something has to be done now so they can live in peace. So right now, what I would like is for her to never get out of jail, ever. That's not going to happen. But I also want, we want her removed out of here. We want to feel safe. As of Friday night, Lake was still in jail, so she could not be reached for comment. Her bail is set at $50,000. I'm Coco McAvoy, Fox 11 News.